Mandera County, realizing that our common aspirations and prosperity lies on the immediate and firm and resolute action on finding homegrown solutions to the education crisis in Mandera County, met at the Granada Hotel in Mandera Town today on the 20th of February 2020 to undertake leader symposium on finding homegrown solutions to the education crisis in Mandera County. And we have resolved as follows. The government should do limited devolution of teachers for a period of four to five years in order for the local leadership to design a proper strategy to get enough teachers who are local so that we, we fix this problem of teachers gap once and for all. And that is only for the northern Kenya. Temporarily, number two, temporarily merge nearby schools in order to benefit them from uh, through synergizing efforts of the few teachers left in schools. Number three, the county government in partnership with Teacher Service Commission, CDF, and the Ministry of Education should recruit and train teachers with proper qualification and further engage retired teachers to teach with the leadership committing to pay them a stipend from Mandela County government and CDF Kitty so as to fill the gap left by non-locals. Number four, a school should employ BOM teachers through the contribution of parents. The challenges caused by Al-Shabaab must be felt by all so that the resentment and countering becomes everybody's res responsibility. Number five, Teacher Service Commission to introduce a special allowance to motivate teachers in this region and encourage the others to join teaching. Number six, that we, the people of Northern Kenya, and by extension Mandera County, will no longer accept to be used as recruitment ground by Teacher Service Commission. Number seven, our brother Professor Magoha must understand that his theory of 100% transition is non-existent in NEP, and in reality, 100% transition target have been severely impacted on in northeastern province because of lack of teachers in schools. And as such, the ministry must wake up from slumber and deal with the problem of school, of school closures due to lack of teachers because it is their primary responsibility. Number eight. It is the responsibility of Teacher Service Commission to make sure that there are teachers in schools. It becomes a slap on the face when Teacher Service Commission arbitrarily takes such a drastic measure of withdrawing teachers from schools without giving alternatives on how the children in this region will pursue their studies, considering that education is a right uh, for everybody. Number nine. The community is to take upon itself to mentor school leavers to join teaching colleges by undertaking massive awareness campaigns uh, across the county. Ministry of Education should reintroduce the in-service courses that they, so that the UTs that are recruited can continue with their training during school holidays. Number 11, we demand from Teacher Service Commission that they channel funds directly to schools to enable boards of management to employ BOM teachers since they have withdrawn the teachers and it's their responsibility to avail teachers. Number 12, the national government should construct houses within schools in northeastern province particularly Mandera, and provide security within the school compound for protection of teachers. And lastly, the leadership of Mandera County should cascade these resolutions to Teacher Service Commission and Ministry of Education. End of resolution. Thank you very much.